Hello friends, in this video we will discuss sexual reproduction in Macrandra species of Udogonium. So we know that Macrandra species is a species in which both the filament, male filament and female filament are similar in morphology but they differ in physiology. Further, this Macrandra species is of two type, it may be monoecious or it may be Diocious. In case of monoecious, both Anthridia and Ugonia develop on single filament. But in case of diocious, they develop in separate filaments. But the process of development of Anthridium and Ugonium it is similar in monoecious and diocious. So we will start sexual reproduction from development of Anthridium. Any intercalary cell which have kept can function as anthridial mother cell. So here in this filament, so this is a filament. In this filament, this cell, this cell which have this cap cell will function as anthridial mother cell. It will divide into two cell, it will divide transversely and mitotically into two cell one larger cell lower larger cell which is called sister cell and upper smaller cell which is called Anthridium. Now, this larger cell, this sister cell, further divide many times and form two to forty anthridium. So, this was the anthridium that was formed earlier, and this row of anthridium it is formed by division of this sister cell. So now, by repeated division of the sister cell, a row of anthridium is formed. In this row, number may vary from 2 to 40. So, it may vary according to species. Now, these anthridium further, each anthridium further divide by vertical wall they will divide vertically and each anthridium forms two cell each anthridium will form two cell by vertical division and after vertical division then each of this cell each cell will Finally, metamorphosis or you can say changes into single anthrazoid. So, each anthridium will form two anthrazoids. Now, after maturation of this anthrazoids this transverse wall this wall this transverse wall split like this so these are this is suppose this is anthridial cell here a transverse wall is there it will split transversely it will split like this and after splitting of this transverse wall two anthrazoids will come in form of vesicle and after some time this vesicle will dissolve and they will come out in water. So this is anthrozoid. So this anthrozoid is this anthrozoid of Macrandra species of Udogonium is a single cell rounded structure with 
पॉइंटेड एंटीरियर एंड एंड इट्स टूवर्ड्स इट्स एंटीरियर एंड इट हैव रो ऑफ फ्लैजिला सो इट इज ए राउंडेड स्ट्रक्चर इट इज पेल सो दिस एंथेरोजोइड ऑफ मैक्रेंडर स्पीसीज ऑफ उडोगोनियम इज पेल ग्रीन इन कलर राउंडेड इन स्ट्रक्चर एंड इट्स एंटीरियर एंड इज दिस इज एंटीरियर एंड इज समवट पॉइंटेड एंड एट दिस एंटीरियर एंड बिलो द एंटीरियर एंड देर इज ए रो ऑफ फ्लैजिला so when we compare this structure to zoo spore of asexual reproduction of udogonium it is similar to the zoo spore but it is smaller than zoo spore now coming to the development of ugonia or female reproductive structure so similar to anthridium any capsule any intercalary capsules any intercalary cell which have a cap can function as ugonial mother cell so it can function as ugonial mother cell here in this filament this is a capsule this is intercalary cell which have cap so it will function as ugonial mother cell it will divide into two cell upper cell and lower cell this lower cell is called Suffoltery cell or also called supporting cell. This upper cell, which becomes rounded, will function as ugonium. It have egg inside ugo inside this cell. So this this whole cell is called ugonium, and this ugonium encloses. Egg. Now, this ugonial cell will form a aperture toward anterior end. So there will be a formation of pore towards anterior end, and cytoplasm towards this region recedes backward. So it here a spot is present. A spot. will form this spot is called receptive spot now a drop of cytoplasm will oozes out will come out from this spot a mucilaginous drop will come out from this spot and <laughs> this mature mature anthrozoid then will reach there because it will secrete some chemo attractant and by this chemo attractant this anthrozoid will be attracted towards this ugonia and it will reach at the mucilaginous drop then when it will reach mucilaginous drop it will come out and it will fuse it will come inside and it will fuse with egg and finally zygote is formed now this zygote after formation will secrete thick wall around itself it will secrete thick wall around itself so first we will talk about anthridia any capsule can functions as anthridial mother cell here this cell functions as anthridial mother cell it will divide mitotically into uh, upper smaller cell and lower larger cell this lower larger cell is called sister cell upper smaller cell is called anthridium this sister cell then further divide and form a row of anthridia number may vary from 2 to 40 these anthridia then divide by vertical division and each anthridium forms two cell so these each cell of a anthridium will form anthrozoid this anthrozoid comes out by transverse splitting of wall and each anthrozoid is a single cell rounded structure it have row of flagella towards its anterior end and it is pale green in color <laughs> now coming to the ugonia any capsule intercalary capsule can function as ugonial mother cell it will divide and form lower suffoltery cell upper ugonium 
और उगोनियल सेल विच फॉर्म उगोनिया विच कंटेन एग नाउ स्पोर विल बी स्पोर विल फॉर्म टूवर्ड एंटीरियर एंड एंड ए साइटोप्लाज्म ओजिज आउट फ्रॉम दिस एंटीरियर एंड फॉर्म ए इन फॉर्म ऑफ ए ड्रॉप सो दिस ड्रॉप सिक्रीट सम कीमो अट्रैक्टेंट एंड बाय सिक्री फ्रॉम दीज कीमो अट्रैक्टेंट्स दिस एंथेरोजोइड विल बी अट्रैक्टेड टूवर्ड्स द उगोनिया इट विल कम देयर फर्स्ट इट विल कम एट this drop and then it will come inside and it will fuse with egg and form zygote after formation of zygote a thick wall is secreted around zygote so this is sexual reproduction in macrandrous species of udogonia